All right. So first thing we're going to do is we're just going to play on the mouthpiece so we so we can see if we can hit that fundamental A on the mouthpiece. Oh, let's hear this. Good, good. Let's try it one more time. Nice. All right. I'm just going to... There we go. All right. So now what we're going to do is we're going to try to play around a little bit, see how flexible we can be with it. Mm -hmm. So let's just, first, let's see how high you can go on the piece. About, about see, and let's see how, how low you can go. So around, right, so right around that A A flat. So that's, that's pretty good. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna little exercise to work on our voicing. Mm -hmm. We're gonna go like A. Just let's see if we can do that. That's pretty good. Let's try it one more time. Go ready. Ready? One. Ready? Go. That's pretty those sque squeeze are be are to be expected. Yeah. They, they happen. <laughs> they happen all the time. That's pretty good. Let's now let's try going A. So let's just try that hitting the the C A once. So that gets a little a little lower. It's a little lower. Eric, we're, we're up in the same. So let's go. There we go. That was good. Let's try it one more time. So yeah, let me take a look at Let's take a little a, a little bit out. Yeah, right there. So, so if we put too much in, it can really cause it to squeak that a lot. So let's take a little bit out. Let's try it one more time. Basically, just to the point where you the black lose, you don't see the black anymore, but not much more than that. Let's, let's, let's start it. There we go. There we go. That's better. Let's try one more time. Let's just see a. There we go. All right. So let's try this. With a B. It's a lot better, which is good. All right, so now what we're going to do is we're going to see if we can work, start working a little lower. Because mm -hmm. when, when, we when we first started, we could only get to about an A flat. So let's start there. Let's do an A, A flat, A. There we go. And as we're getting lower, really think to really open up all through here. Just really relax. I'm just going to go A, G. Let's try it one more time. Let's let's get solid A. Pretty good for there. All right, so now we're going to move on to the rest of it written down here. So we're going to have you assemble your saxophone. Okay. So if you want to go ahead and do that.
So let's just hear. So what notes have you guys started learning in class? Um, G, A, B, C, and then the D register. Okay. Okay. Let's start with a nice, like a nice open G. It's a, not open. It's a regular G. It's really relaxing. So we're actually, we're actually hitting the, an upper partial. So let's really relax. So it's like. There we go. That's better. We're still, I think we're really tight all through it. So let's think when we're, we're using our armature, yeah. like a big, like a, if you put your, like this around your mouth, you know, even pressure all the way around. So it looks oh. like right now it might be a little flat. It's going to get even pressure all the way around the mouthpiece. Let's try one more time. Let's try an A. Okay, let's go up to B. Let's go C. Nice. And let's try D with the register key. Nice. Nice. And let's go back down. So we got C. A. Tone is and it's really well in tune, which is really good right now. So let's just try some of some it's like nice little exercise called go G G G G A. So one, one more tongue on side. So we just want to use like almost like clarinet, the tip. I don't know if she if she ever said the tip of the top of the tongue to the tip of the top of the reed. Yeah, I don't know how I remember. I'm glad I remember that because that's amazing. But we went really far, I think, right? Tip of tongue. And when we start, we want to start with the off the reed and it's going da. Yeah. So let's just try it on a D. And you have a really nice, really nice release. So when we release on sax, we don't use tongue on my clarinet. We just let it go. Yeah. Which that's actually that's really nice. All right. Well, we can try this now. We can try going low on the saxophone. Okay. So this is gonna be we're gonna be a lot less, lot less pressure up here. It's really relaxed, really open throat, and really think low. Like think think of bass. Okay. Bass. Let's start on C. Second one down.
It's oh, yeah. just it's really an E flat scale, E flat contra pitch, but it's C major scale. Yeah. Right. So yeah. So the working low is really crucial on saxophone because then we can really start to develop our embouchure and really start to develop voicing. Mm -hmm. Alright, so let's try one more time. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I mean, so. 